What's up guys, Nick here with a brand new unboxing video. Yes, another one. Wow, so many. This time, I just traded in a bunch of games I wasn't even playing. Like, they were just taking up space in my drawer. So I'm like, you know what? Let's just get rid of a bunch of them. And it got me two games. So thank you, GameStop, for once. All right. The first game we're going to do, Tales of Zestiria. Tales of Zestiria. I think it's brand new. It is, isn't it? It just recently came out, 2015. Okay, it came out last year. Came out. Uh, no, it's not sealed. It's uh, it's actually a used copy, but you know, first time I've ever gotten it. So you got all, I guess, all the main characters on front. I don't know who they are. <sighs> Engage your passion and fight to save the world. The dawn of a new hero emerges. Take the role of S Sori. Sori, a young man destined to become the legendary shepherd. Okay. As he navigates a medieval fantasy realm filled with magic, dragons, and mystery, with the help of the woman of the woman of the lake, uncover the mysteries of the lost civilization and fulfill the shepherd's destiny. Experience the rush of fluid, real-time active battle system of a of a. Okay, I don't say it the way. Explore beautiful wilderness, ominous ca caverns, and uh, bus. <laughs> some of these words. Bustling cities of a vibrant fantasy world. Immerse yourself in the shepherd's quest as Sori meets new allies and embarks on a journey to rescue a world of turmoil. One to four players? What? You can have four players at the same time. Holy shit. Uh, th 13 gigabyte, and that's it. I saw a game, though, uh, Halo 5. Or not Halo 5. Is it 5? Yeah, Halo 5 is 70 gigabytes. Jesus. Rated T for alcohol reference, blood, mild language, suggestive things, use of alcohol, and violence. Check something first. All right, the disc. There's nothing wrong with the disc, and I buy used just because. And there's actually a different cover on the back. That or er, it looks nice. It's a nice, nice looking game. And as for doing a first look on it. I'm not going to, actually. Uh, uh, some viewers might get mad because I'm not doing one. It's because it's an RPG. RPGs take forever to get started. So I'm going to avoid doing a first look on that one, at least. This next one, I will do. And it is... I can't really tell you the name. Well, actually, I could. Earth Defense Forced... F Earth Defense Force 4, The Shadow of New Despair. This one's on sale, actually, as you can tell by the many stickers from GameStop. Uh, I've heard about the first two. I've never had a chance to play them. Third one, I'm, I haven't even seen. And he actually, this is a new copy, and he put a plastic thing around it, so it makes it you know, look like it's in a little thing. So, kudos. Uh, I don't know anything about the game. I was, oh, no, 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 no. It's Earth Defense Force 4.1. Kill it with fire. Nobody likes bugs, especially when they're 50 feet tall and eating your city. Gear up with hundreds of deadly weapons and vehicles. Smash those creepy crawlies for good. Pick your exterminator. The trap-happy air raider, the dual-wielding fencer, the versatile ranger, or the flyer deadly wing diver. Team up with other quadrants to eliminate enemies with Advanced alien weaponry and devastate world machines. Interesting. Rated M for blood, language, and violence. Doesn't seem like it should have rated R, or rated M. So let's get her open. I went straight in there. It always do it this way. I mean, it, it may not even come out this this wall and I may not be able to grab it because I cut my fingernails yesterday. Okay, come on. It, it's, it's plastic that I actually think they should use for that. I mean, I could have easily just done this. Well, actually not. Never mind. So just pull it out. And I am going to get rid of all these markings and stuff like that. Good. Go oh, there's actually a manual. Holy shit. There is actually... A full manual. Wow. 
You don't see those in these games anymore. That's surprising. That's for the disc. It's basically the dude on the front of the game. The uh, dude out there. But uh, thank you all for watching this unboxing video. Stay tuned for tomorrow, actually, because I don't like uploading more than two videos a day. Uh, stay tuned tomorrow for Earth Defense Force first look, because I'm probably going to shoot it like right now. So I'll catch you all next time. Peace.